Okay, all right. Good afternoon, students. Good afternoon, everyone. So time check, it's 1.56. So we still have four minutes um, before we finally or formally start our Canvas orientation. So I would just like to remind everyone to our dear students to refrain from chatting. If your chat is not necessary, so please do not use the chat box to say hi, hello to your classmates. All right. Or else I will be, um, uh, I will set the, I will set the chat box into post only. Okay. So we will be using the chat box later on for our Q&A or if you have clarifications or problems okay um, on today's orientation okay so again may i remind everyone to please um remain yourself muted so that we won't be distracting the speaker or the one that we will give you an orientation for the day if possible if your connection is good kindly turn on your cameras but if not so it's okay we will make a consideration of that again so as what i have mentioned use the chat box okay for your queries or if you have concerns and clarifications and if uh, if you really want to speak up especially if you have problems so you can you, you can unmute that's the time that you will be allowed to unmute yourself and talk to our um, teachers or talk to the one who will present or the one who will orient you today. Most especially, you have to rename your Zoom. Now, this is for attendance checking. This is for you to, or this is for us to easily check if you're here during the orientation time or period. So please rename your Zoom. Um, started with the grade level and, of course, the letter of your home room. So say, for example, for A, B, A and B for the grade school, and then we have for the grade 7 and 8, so they have up to E. And then followed by your last name and then first name. For those who doesn't know how to rename their Zoom, so you can look at the grid or your tile okay, in your video. And what you see there is the three dots. Okay, click the three dots there and then na ay mo appear dira na. Okay, so nsa mo appear. So there is this. Okay, so ask to unmute and something and then look for rename. Okay, you can click the rename and then you type in your grade level, your last name, and then your first name. Okay, so that your teacher or your advisor, if they are around, they can easily identify you. And also, we can easily identify what grade level you belong. All right, so thank you very much. So it's one more minute to go. I think we are about to start our orientation for this afternoon. Again, to those who have problem on their cameras, Okay, you are not uh, forced to turn it on, but if makaya sa inyong connection and you have no difficulty, technical difficulties in turning that on, then it is also good. Okay, so to formally start with our orientation today, so once again, this is your host for today. I will be the one to facilitate and later on we'll introduce um, our LMS coordinator who will give you the Canvas orientation. So I am Mam Jeva Minjola. Okay, so and welcome to our Canvas orientation for grades 4 to 8. Again, I would like to remind for this quick reminder and most especially to rename your Zoom. Right. To start with, let us start our orientation with a prayer. Okay, so let us all remember that we are in the most holy presence of God. Okay, again, I would like to request everyone to please remain muted. Okay, mute yourself. Okay, so that we won't be distracted. All right. 
Okay. So are we good? Okay, for a while. Okay, once again, so let us all remember that we are in the most holy presence of God in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Okay. So let us listen to the prayer. So again, may I remind you to refrain from using the chat to say hi and hello to your schoolmates. We will be using our chat box or our chat for queries and concern on today's orientation. Okay? So this is this are warning, ha? Kaning mga na, nag, nagsigigya po ng audio sa chat box. Okay? Remember that the salians are disciplined. Okay, so formally introduce to you our um, the one who will give you the orientation of our LMS. So let me give you a short overview of what will happen today. So again, so this is uh, Canvas orientation. Canvas is our new LMS. Uh, we have shifted or we have um, uh, we have shifted from the previous LMS, which is the Keeper, because there are some of the features that is not found in the previous LMS, but, but there is in the Canvas. Okay? That's why we decided to have our new LMS. So what we're going to do today is we will be having our onboarding, meaning we will be signing up to our Canvas account. So what you need for the onboarding is you need to have your laptop as much as possible, much better, a PC or laptop. But if you don't have, you can uh, also use your Android, Android phone. But make sure that that Android phone or make sure also that you are connected to 
internet because it won't be possible or it won't be successful if wala mo internet connection. Right? So, um, I think um, I am now ready to introduce to you our LMS coordinator who will be giving you the onboarding on today's orientation. So, he is no other than Mr. Eduardo Amiduria or Sir Dudes. You can call him Sir Dudes, our LMS coordinator. Sir Dudes. Please give him a round of virtual applause. <laughs> Okay, Sir Dudes. Yes, Ma'am Java. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. All right. So, good afternoon. Uh, um, grade 4, Grade 5, Grade 6, Grade 7, and Grade 8 students. So, I hope you are well this afternoon. So, the main uh, task this afternoon is for you to get on board with our new LMS, which is the Canvas. So this year I'll be the one who will manage the canvas. So if you have any concerns, if you have any problems regarding the canvas, you may consult me. Once you are here in school, you can consult me directly. So just ano, dun, huwag kayong mahiyam lumapit sa akin for canvas concerns, right? Now, uh, please allow me to share my screen. Okay. Can you see the presentation? Yes. 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 Uh, yes. Uh, yes. So this year's learning management system is um, Canvas. Okay, it's a new learning management system, and. We got it from Instructure, which is it is a web-based company, which is uh, we call Instructure. And actually, they're the one who uh, are the one who manage the Canvas. Okay. So why Canvas? Um, previously, Kanina, Mam Java said that um, there are features in um, our previous learning management system, which is Quipper which is not, um, um, somehow we were able to have some issues in Kuiper, but um, we decided this time to use Canvas and um, we hope that this time it will be a uh, much, uh, a much uh, improved learning management system for our school. So it is a collaboration software for distributing courses over the internet so in here you can use canvas as a communication tool for, to enrich learning okay, you can communicate with your teachers your subject teachers your um, classmates as well and it is also capable of um, engaging students and increasing the achievement of the students okay um, at the same time, students can be engaged in the class beyond the actual room and the set class time. Since um, you can access this uh, one over the internet, so you have, if you have a free time, you can access our LMS in doing assignments, quizzes, and reading some of the learning materials. Now, these are some of the basic features of Canvas. There are a lot of features of Canvas, but I am going to give only five since these are, these are the common and the basic features of Canvas. So one, um, it can be used as a communication tool. This is where the teachers will um, um, download or embed all of their learning materials. You can collaborate. Um, teachers and students can collaborate uh, your work so that uh, through discussions, through pieces, through different media um, forms. And it is also a learning resources since um, all of the um, activities, the reading materials, the notes, 
will be embedded in our um, learning management system, which is Canvas. It has also a mobile app of which um, later on we will, uh, I'll discuss or I'll show to you also how to get an access of our mobile app. And of course, um, it has a parents portal so that the parents will act as a observer. Um, they will not actually act uh, um, as part of the, you know, the features, but uh, they will only be uh, at, acting as an observer. So that means they can see your performance. If you have missing um, assignments, missing quizzes, your parents will know and that they, they will then remind you to um, answer some, some of your missing um, good morning, quizzes good morning, and assignments. Good morning, mom and sis. Okay. So let's get started with our onboarding. So to get you on board, um, you'll be needing a PC or a laptop, or if you have a device, an iPad device, you can use that one. So first, um, before we start, I want you to open any browser that you have. It can be Google Chrome, it can be Mozilla or whatever you have in your um, computer. Then, in the URL address, in this part, you type in... Sir, I'm using phone. Oh, okay. Um, if you're using a phone, there is also a browser on your phone. What phone is that? Is it an Android or an iPhone? Android. Okay, if it's an Android, you look for the Google, um, Google Chrome um, icon and then you open that one. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So you have here in your URL address um, bar, type in lsa.instructure.com. Now, once you type in, after typing in, you press enter. Then you will be given this um, display. Can I see a thumbs up if you're already on this display? Wala po. Hindi po ako makapasok. Me too, sir. Sir, I can't. Me too, sir. Hindi ako makapasok ko, sir. Me too, sir. You cannot get in. I can't get in. Sir, nana ko. Hindi ako makapasok, sir. Nana ko, nana ko, sir. 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 <laughs> can you go I'm back down. to the Quran? Because I'm not done yeah. yet. I'm down. Kids. Okay, kids. So this is if nakalag in na kayo. Okay, so no need for you to inform na lag in na. Okay. Okay, so erase nyo na lang ang virtual hand nyo if nakalag in na. Sure, I don't have an account. Can you please use the chat box para magka uh, dungga na ita, okay? So, ito is naka-mute, uh, naka-mute na sir. Ah, oh, okay. Okay. Teacher? So, yes. Done? Are Done, we sir. Your email password? Okay, you have to wait, okay? So now that um, you are already on this um, display, so let me finish first the first six steps that you're going to do, and then we will go back to step number one, okay? Do not do it, do not do not my, the process not yet. mine looks like. Okay. Um, before doing, uh, six steps, let me finish first uh, the explanation and then we will go back, we will do it uh, all together. Okay, so if you have this display, then the first step is to type the email address. The email address that you're going to type there is your school email address, which has an lsa.ph. So let's say for example, a.idoria at lsa.ph. Okay, 
the next step is since you don't have a password yet, what we will do next is to click that button that for that password. Okay. Then after clicking that forgot password, Canvas will give you this screen or this window. Then what you will do here, you are going to type your email address again, the LSA.ph email address. And then you click request password. So after clicking request password, you have to wait for an email coming from Canvas. So what you do here, you have to check your email using your lsa.ph account. So most likely the response time is up to 30 minutes. Okay. So in your email address, if you cannot receive in your inbox, you try to check your spam. Okay. And once you receive Sir, the email, yes. I can't go in because it doesn't allow me to go in when I log in. I, I did not give you the instructions yet pa to log in. I'm still in the process of discussing the procedure. We will do it all together later, okay? So once you receive the email coming from Canvas, the password, you have to click the link and you will be given this window. What will you do there? Uh, what will you do here is you will type your school email address and then you type your, your password and confirm password and then click update password. Once you are done with that, you go back to the login page. Okay, these are the steps. So we go back to the previous steps so that we will do it all together this time. Okay. So this is step number one. Type your email address now. On that. Sir, di ko yan makita. Hmm? Sir, ito po, ito po ba yun? Hmm. That you should be seeing, the canvas hasn't messaged me yet, sir. You should be seeing this display. Okay, if you are not seeing this display, then you are maybe uh, sure. your sure. computer is set to a sure. high resolution, a high resolution um, setting. So you just click in the uh, type in the email. And then after typing your email address, you click forget password. That's not my display, sir. How do I go to you that just, display? Uh, if, if you don't have that display, maybe you are set into a high resolution display. So just, how do we do that? just type your email and then click forget password. Sure, well, I forgot password. Oh. You should be on, um, uh, basically, um, maybe you have typed in the wrong uh, URL because um, some of uh, the others are having this one. So you should be having the same display. I see it. I see it. I see it. pa, nakabutang dito. Then sure. after clicking forget password, this will appear. You need to type your email address again and then request password. Sir. After I that, tried... you will wait for 30 minutes. Yes, you can speak now. I done it. You just have to spam the request password okay. until it and check your email again. Teacher, teacher what canvas? I got in. Um, sir, sir, I, I, I don't see the... Teacher. I'm logged in now. I'm logged in now, sir. Some I'm logged in also, sir. sir. Some are not. So for those who are logged in, can you please stand by? 
because we will try to resolve muna the issues of those students who cannot log in. Okay, sir. Okay. Excuse me, sir. Um, it doesn't work for me, but I already have a password, but it doesn't let me log in. Oh, why is that? So if you have the password, you should have logged in already. So maybe there is a, a mistake in the process. Sure, do it. So you have to redo it again. Yes? Yes, I already, I already received the forgot password in the Gmail. So what am I going to do? All right. So once you are done, you, you received that one. Did you do this one already? Pwede ang LaSalle password or our own password? Pwede ang LaSalle password. It's up to you huh? uh, what password you Wale, nakabutang din na, Sir Dudes. Why na you can, you can set your own password. Eh? Um, excuse me po, sir? Yes. Um, can I... I tried to log into my LSA, pero it didn't work. LSA what? LSA that email? Teacher, di ko po. Ay, sir, di ko po makita yung ano. Yung... I can't log in. Okay, again ha, again. I will log in na. I will go back to step number one. Okay. Para those students who are having issues in logging in, we can resolve that one. You should have the same display because Hi, sir. Good afternoon. other students are having the same display. Sir, I've logged in. Okay. So the first step is this. Open any browser. It can be Google Chrome. It can be Mozilla Firefox. It can be Safari. Um, excuse Then you type the address, the URL address above, lsa.instructure.com. Then after typing that, you press enter, and then you will be given this display. It should be this display. If, that, if this is not the display, then uh, you are not, uh, not on the uh, prescribed site that we have in that the school is using. So in this um, particular window, what you will do here is type your email address the one that is given to you by the school, the one with the lsa.ph email address. So after typing the email address, do not give any password at this moment. What you will do is you click forgot password button. Okay. After clicking that, you will be given this window. So what will you do? You type your email address again, the one with the lsa.ph, and you click the request password button. From here, you need to transfer uh, to your Gmail. You have to open your Gmail because that is where the canvas will send the link for you to change the password. So you have to open the inbox. If you are, if you cannot receive it in your inbox, you try to check your spam. Okay, you try to check the spam, and then some of the canvas, you know, link is sent through spam if it's not going through your inbox. So once you, I know that one. The waiting time, the waiting time for that is from one to thirty minutes. So kung hindi ka pa nakareceive, you just wait because ang dami nating we are four hundred seventy nine. So um, may, it can be it can cause traffic somehow. So you just wait for thirty minutes and then Canvas will send you the link for you to change the password. Now once. You have the link, you need to click that link. Then you will be given this window after clicking the link. So this time you can now set your new password. So after setting the new password, there are three steps here. 
you have to type your school email if it asks for your school email and then you type your password any password that you want for your canvas account and then you confirm your password and <coughs> click update password after that you go to the login page which is this one so in your login page this time you type your email address and then you type your password because you have already set a password and then you click log in so after clicking log in my tips is you bookmark this page so that anytime you are going to access your canvas account it will just be it will be easy for you to locate that one because you have bookmarked it as your Web, uh, with, um, page and then you save the password in your pc so that every time you open your canvas you, what you will do is you will be clicking only log in because um your computer already saves your email and your password okay that those are the tips that i will give you so that every time you use your canvas your login so after you click the login, -log -log you will be given this -log -in ako. template. All right. Hindi ko ka log in, sir dude. Ka log right. in ako. Excuse me. Okay, so wait mo na ha. Yes, mo na. sir dude. Yes. I'm logging oh. now. Okay, for those who are able to log in, kindly please use your um, virtual raising of hands up so that we will know kung ilan na yung naka on board. Excuse okay. me, Sir Dude. Yes. yes, you may. Speak I up. I already go, got to request, I, mean, I already got to, you know what, I, the password thing, and it says, then we will send you a link to change your password. Yes. And then when you press request password, it, it said, it says this, your password recovery instructions will be sent to r.balanaiaslsa.ph. This may take up 30 minutes. So I am done. Yes. This, what does that mean? You need to check your email. Um, check your email. You go to your um, email on your inbox. If you cannot see that one in your inbox, you check your spam. Okay. Thanks. Okay. Again, uh, for those who are able to log in and has already this display on their screen, I would like to request that you uh, give us a oh, raising of hand um, reaction so that we will know on board. Yes. The, the, com, it's the, the Canvas uh, password is not here. I've been waiting. Okay, just wait. Kasi wala pang 30 minutes pa naman. 30 okay. minutes yung waiting time. Sir, ayun niya po mag-log in sa ko. Again, again? Sir, ayun niya po mag-log in sa account ko. I have tried many times. Did you have already, did you set where your password already? Yes. Sinasabra po. Sir, di ako mag-password. Sinasabra po. Again, again, I can one by one lang, one by one. Okay, so sige, sige again, yung password, yung ayaw makalag in. Ayaw niya mag log in sa akin. Sa, siya sabi, please try again. Your, your password or username is invalid. Oh. Ibig sabihin niya, may mali sa email address mo at saka sa password mo. Okay? Baka nagkaroon ka ng uh, space dyan sa email address. Excuse me, app. sir, dudes. Yes. Dilipod ko kasulod sa akong Canvas app. Hmm. Bakit nasa app ka na? Hindi pa tayo sa app. Nasa ano pa tayo? Mamaya pa yung app. What are you using? Sa website, sir, kaya na. Oh, mamaya na yung app. Okay, sa website muna tayo. Dito muna tayo sa computer. Okay. So again, students, I cannot see, ano? Uh, ah. Sister? Marami na pala naka, ano? 
This me, sir. Yes, who are you? You can speak now. Sorry, I'm late. I I just got the new link. Okay, what is that link? For the canvas orientation. Oh, okay. Um what what are you using now? Are you using your laptop or your computer? PC. Okay, your PC. So I will go back once again. Ah, you you observe what to Excuse do. Excuse me, sir, dudes. Can I leave now or not yet? No, not yet, because we will still have the mobile app. Ano, my mobile app pa. So wait, muna. Last na to. Excuse me, sir. Is it okay if I go open sa my laptop? I'm using phone kasi kasi may ano. Um, yes, it's okay. You go um, and open your laptop. Excuse me, sir. Um, excuse me, po, sir. Sir. Yes, um, one sir? by one na. Okay. So again, students, uh, I'll go back again to the first step. Okay, yung mga na late, yung ngayon pa nakapasok, this is the first step that you are going to do. However, yung mga tapos na, just wait because we still have some things to do. Okay, yung mga tapos na yung nakalagi, naka-onboard na sa canvas, just wait for a minute. I'll just go back again to so that I can uh, cater some of those who are not yet on board. Excuse me, sir? Yes. I have problems logging logging in, and I made sure that my password and email is right because I have the password to my Gmail. Yeah, I copied everything. It still won't work. Like I know this. I know that I did not mistype anything. Yeah, I cannot log in for some reason. What what particular step are you now? Uh, trying to log in. In where? Canvas. Canvas. Yes. Okay, I'll go back to you in a minute, huh? For a while. I'll just that actually it's, happened it's, to me. Sure. Okay. Sure. So for uh, wait, wait, muna. I'll go back to the procedure, muna, kasi merong hindi naka ano ng procedure. So after that, I'll cater your questions and your concerns. Okay. Sure. Can I so open my laptop? Um, this is what you're going to do. You open any browser, your Google Chrome browser or your Safari, or your Mozilla, any browser that you have in your computer. And then type in lsa.instructure.com on the URL address bar. Okay, I am showing you here at the top. Okay, after you type that one, you will be given this window. So from here, you type your email address, the one that which has an lsa.ph email address. Okay. Second step is you click forget password since you don't have a password yet. Right. You click forget password. And after clicking forget password, you type your email address again because Canvas will give you this window. And then type your email address again. And then you click request password. So from, from here, um, you will wait for Canvas to send the link to your email. So what you will do here is you go, you open your email, your lsa.ph email. Okay, you open that one, check your inbox or your spam. Because that is where sometimes the canvas will send the link in the spam or in the inbox. Once you have the link, you click the link and you will be given this window, the one that you can see on the left. So what you will do here is you type your school email. If it asks for the school email, then type your password. You set your password, you confirm your password, and then you click update password. And after that, you go back to the login page, which is this one. This is the login page. So this time, you will supply another password. Of course, you type your email, you type your password, and then you click login. So it has to be, uh, no, 
that one oh, and then like, <laughs> mark your page then save the password in your mic. after that you should have this one so please mute, uh, mute yourselves what are the beginner Okay. Sir, asan magkikita yung spam box? You are muted, sir. Okay, I will you know, I will stop sharing and then I will share again. Wait lang. Excuse me, sir, if you're familiar with Canvas, is it okay if we leave? Oh wait, no, no, not yet. Ah, okay. We because have to we have to wait for the mobile team. Okay, so the one that asks, where, where can you see your spam? Here, if you have opened your email, it, in this part right here, you, you click more, and then you can see the spam right there. Okay? You should be able to see the spam once you click more. Okay, thanks, Chair. All right. So Can I will turn? push. Sir, wala pagiya pa nag-send sa kong Gmail. Okay. If that's the case, kapag hindi pa nag-send, we will have to wait until the end of the day. And then, kapag uh, natapos na yung araw na hindi pa rin nag-send, by the time you will come here to school tomorrow or what whatever is your schedule, you approach me and then I will help you personally so that you can get on board with our Canvas. Okay? So no need to worry. Yung mga hindi pwede makapag-on board ngayon, by the time you will come here to school, you approach me directly so that I can help you getting on board on your canvas. So I will just continue with my, uh, no? uh, let me continue with my presentation. Okay. So this time we will do the, we will uh, install the mobile app. Okay. So for the mobile app, you need to download and install Canvas for students. Be sure that you are going to download and install the Canvas for students because there is a Canvas for teachers and Canvas for parents. Sir, so make sure. Excuse me, sir. Yes. Nag-charge pa ko cellphone, sir. Di ba ko ka-download? All right. Uh, if that's the case, uh, you can do it later. You just have to uh, take note of the uh, take note of the procedure. Okay. Excuse me, sir. Yes. I cannot download it because I'm using an iPad and it's not my iPad and then I need uh, a password and I don't know the password. All right. So if that's the case, again, you just take note of the procedure and then you can download it uh, later tonight once you have the password, okay? Just take note of this procedure for the mobile app. You can take a picture of this one. Okay, again, for the mobile app, you need to download and install Canvas for students. So again, um, I am uh, trying to say and repeat it again. Make sure that you download the Canvas for students okay? because there is a Canvas for parents and Canvas for teachers. So make sure when you download Canvas for students. All right. So once you have downloaded, yes, me, sir. Ah, yes. Ah, not sa mga mobile. Yes. Uh, this is for the mobile. Kanina that is for the PC and laptop. This time this is for the mobile, for the cell phone, or for the iPad. Because you can use a uh, Canvas uh, in mobile and your PC. Um, excuse me, sir. Excuse me, sir. Yes. yes. I have to inform you that it, when I download the Canvas app, Canvas student app here, it won't work. 
Why? I don't know. Okay. Uh, uh, okay. Maybe you are having issues with the uh, compatibility of the, I know the unit that you have because a canvas. Uh, if it has, if your unit has a lower version, then it canvas is somehow choosing some versions of forms that are um, the new ones or the new series of forms. All right, for those who have the app, just wait, huh? Just wait. So for Mac users, you go to App Store, then search and install Canvas for students. For Android, you go to the Play Store, then search and install Canvas for students. Excuse me, sir. Excuse me. Yes. It is Bilieta from Grade 3 St. Clair. Um, I have to leave and I ha I'm going to change into my ano, laptop. Is it okay? I'm using phone right now. Yeah, it's okay. Thank you very much. Excuse me. Yes, who are you? Ryan. Ryan, okay, go. So, I try to do it a lot of times, but it doesn't make me do it. I tried all the steps. I did. It's all correct. Okay. So. Sir, uh, dude, is this later, correct? Later, Ryan. Huh? Later, Ryan. I will. Um, Sir, dude. Excuse me. Share your screen so that I can see what's the problem. Excuse me. Uh, let, for a while lang, let me finish and then we'll go to the question and uh, answer. Okay. So for the Canvas mobile app, okay, once you have this one, you click Find My School. You, if you have already installed the application, you click Find My School and then type, type this one. The next step is to type this school, La Sala Academy, close and open parenthesis, Philippines. And then uh, enter. Then you, it, you will be brought back uh, to our official Canvas oh. instance. Okay. Sir, I have a question, sir. All right, sige. I will entertain the questions. Server. Yes. So mobile, sir. Um, is the name? Is it the name? Um, Canvas Student. Yes, Canvas Student. I okay. I can I can see it now. Thank you. I nakatanulod. All right. So, um, we will have it one by one for your concerns. Ryan, the one kanina. Um, uh, Ryan, can you hear me? Yes. Okay. Um. Let me. If you can share me your screen, you can. Hey, wait. Screen. Let me just start broadcast it. Okay. Here. Here. You see my screen, right? Yeah, I can see your screen. Well, I'm going to go to Canvas. Wait. I got to find school, and it says the Sal Academy. So I clicked it. Then it's going to say loading. And then after that, it's it leads me here. I so so I decided to follow your steps and what you did. Wait. Basta like that. And then after that, I'm gonna log in. Wait, forget I forgot. Password. Forgot password, Kamuna Ryan. Oh, wait. I wait. I know. I mean, wait. I forgot that step. Wait, let me just do it again. Did you wait, do the step go, already in forgetting password? Let me, go, let me go here and then let me just type my email. And I requested it and it was sent. Now I decided to now type that. 
Go to your email. You need to go to your email, Ryan. Sorry, you can also in. use the QR to log in faster. You need to go to your email. So that uh, the QR? link. Forgot password. Click here to set a new password. Look at what's going to happen. I got there and it just leads me here. It just leads me here. It just leads me here. Like what happened? Okay. I got password. Okay. I will I will add check your account later, Ryan. Huh? And then once I'm done checking your account, I'll inform you that your account is already okay. Okay. So for now, um, can you please uh, stop sharing? I'll look into this okay. concern. Okay. Sige. What it's else? Mr. Dudes, it's still for me. Even when I redid it. Even uh, when I keep trying to put my password in, it doesn't work. Um, who, uh, who are you? Lucas. Okay. Um, what's your name? Lucas Kelechi Dianyo. Okay, so what we will do is um, Mam Ma Jeba will uh, give a link in our chat box for your concerns, okay? Because um, we cannot um, do it here individually in our Zoom. So Mam Ma Jeba I will... I have finished answering the Google uh, Forms. Okay, Mam Ma Jeba already sent that the, fo the, Google, the Google Form in the chat ah. box for you to type in your concerns I, and sir. I will look into it individually so that you can uh, be on board on your canvas. Sir. Yes. Okay. So, What's GHS? Okay. Um, for now, let me continue with the orientation. This is the last part of the orientation already. Okay. Sir Dudes, hindi ko pa nakukuha yung password. Okay. Yung mga hindi pa nakakuha ng password, fill in na lang, ano, fill in the Google form so that I can address your issue individually para ma, ano, makita ko dito sa aking um, system. Sir what is Thank that you. noise? I don't know. Can you please uh, mute? Okay. Can you please mute for those? Uh, no. Can you please mute? Thank you. Sir, I have a question. Sir, you're muted. Okay, I will entertain this one last question. And then I will proceed with my orientation. And then right, for okay. those questions na hindi ko ma-entertain na yon, you look into the chat box. There is a Google form link. And then you uh, fill in the Google form for your concern so that I can look into it personally, okay? Okay. Okay. So, sige. sige yung last sir. question. Hi, okay. Um, sir, is... Is the is the name of the school name of the um of the of the mobile of the mobile canvas is it La Salle Academy LSA dash Philippines? Okay, can you see that? No, I share it in the screen. Can you see that one? I, oh, thank you, thank you. All right. So Sir. yes. Sir, I when I try my password uh, school account, it won't work. Uh, okay. I think maybe there's a baka nakalimutan or mali na yung password mo. So first thing first is we need to solve mo na yung problem mo sa password ng school account bago natin masolve yung but in ano in Canvas, kasi you don't need the password for the school account because you will be setting a new password. So I just fill in the Google form and then I look into that one in my system, okay? 
So for the last part, for our summary, uh, um, hindi pa pala. Um, once you have this one, okay, you have your account, your dashboard, your courses. So if, if you click into your account, I'll just stop sharing and then I'll share my um, canvas. Okay, from here, um, you have here your account, in your account, that is where you can set the notifications. Teacher. So, yes, Paul. Uh, the, the email for the reset password still hasn't been sent to me. I've been waiting. It's been past 30 minutes. Ako, sir. Okay, if that's the case, you fill in the Google form that is in the chat box so that I can look into and into your concern. Okay, just fill in the Google form. Okay, now, to continue with the orientation, in your um, template, you can see here your account menu, your uh, dashboard. Okay, so in your account menu, Okay, in your account menu, you can have the notifications. Uh, you can also, this is where you can change your profile. You can put in there your biography, your photograph. And then the next menu is for the files. Uh, for the files, all of the files that you will be uploading soon, the pictures, the videos, the PDF files, it will be automatically saved here on your files menu in your account tab. Now for the settings, you can also set um, the settings here. Uh, what I want you to do here is um, you can explore this one for your notification for your account settings. The next thing that I want to know is your dashboard. Now in your dashboard, you can see here the different course styles. Uh, my display will be different from yours because I have already a lot of course, uh, course style in my account. So it could be that in your account, you have one or two course styles. Basically what is there is your subjects from what level you belong to. So let's say you have English 4 or English 5 or Aralim Panlipunan 7, like that one that will appear once your teacher publish their uh, module. So if you can only see one, then maybe your teacher was not able to publish yet the module. So you have to wait for your teacher to publish the course and then you can see that one automatically. So if you click here in your courses, you can also see the list of the courses that you are enrolled in for this school year. So you don't need to enroll in your different subjects because once you are already on board, then automatically the subjects, the, uh, the course styles here represents the subjects that you are enrolled. It will automatically populate your um, dashboard. So no need to enroll because I am the one who's doing that one already. So for the last part, um, wait. I have a question. Yes. When we log in to, into our account for the first time, do we already have courses or not yet? Ah, if you were able to do it correctly, um, the procedure that I gave for the first time, once, I know, if your teacher already published the courses, then automatically mayroon ka nang makikitang courses dyan. However, if si teacher hindi pa siya nag-publish ng course, then wala ka pang makikita dyan. It's plain white. Okay? But um, Ma'am Jeba already instructed the teachers to publish their courses. So basically, um, tonight or tomorrow, you will be seeing around 
four tiles, four core styles in your ano, two um I think that's four tiles that you can see on your um, dashboard. All right, so for the last part of our orientation, um, what I want to emphasize here is um, I want you to visit this um, particular um, web page here, community.canvaslms.com. So in this um, web page, uh, you will be able to see some tutorials on how are you going to um, use your canvas lms so i'll just show you i'll just show um, how to do it in our canvas lms here um community.canvaslms.com so you can type that one in your um, browser and then can I leave now? For a while. This is the last part. After this, you can leave. Okay. So here, um, once you are here in our community canvas, you click in canvas and then click canvas LMS. So once we do that, you can see the different canvas guides. So you have to look for this one. View resource for your canvas role as a student. You click that one and then you click in student videos. So from here, canvas will give you uh, different what is the name? Can you please mute? Mm. Mm. Excuse me, can mm. you mute? It's so annoying. Let uh, Mr. Bunny um, use talk. your mic. <laughs> okay, so after that, once you are in the different, uh, in this view, you can view all of these student videos. This will teach you how to navigate on your canvas um, instance okay there are different videos this will uh, the videos here will teach you uh, the calendar overview the dashboard overview how to submit your quiz how to submit your assignment so basically this will help you in navigating your canvas instance okay so again i'll do the steps huh? uh, how to get here you click canvas you click Canvas and then after that, look for Canvas LMS. And then you look for um, Canvas role, which is a student because you're a student. Click that one. And then student videos. So from here, you scroll down and then you can see your student videos. You can watch that one so that um, it can help you navigate your Canvas instance. Okay. So before I will end my orientation, for those who have concerns, I hope you were able to answer the Google form that was set by Ma'am Jeba in our chat box so that I can address your concerns individually. And then once you are here in school, can you please consult me personally so that I can address your concern also if there's if I was not if like I, if I cannot um, address that one tonight yeah, yeah. then you approach me personally once you are here in school girl yeah everything be all right ma'am Jeb Can we lower our hands now okay. yes okay thank you you can lower sir. your hands now can we leave now? Okay, thank you. Okay, you just wait for a while, students. Yes, uh, classes, no? The orientation of the LMS. Okay, so once again, thank you very much, sir, dudes. And thank you so much, dear Spence. So we will end our orientation with a prayer.
Okay. So let us remember that we are in the most holy presence of God. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. All together. Oh my God, do all my actions for this. Prayer, I will continue. Oh my God, to do all my actions. Give Jesus in our hearts. Forever. 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 Forever.